Merry Christmas Eve! Woo! We finally made it! Have we? Wow! Okay, so today is going to be quite a personal video as today I thought I would do a Christmas memories and also I'm going to insert a clip that I made back in like 2013 of one of my Christmases so I hope you enjoy it and yeah! Insert intro. Also, I'd like to apologise for the sound. I have been noticing the weird hissing sound. Um, can I fix it? No, not at the moment. I do need to make sure that the right setting is on, so just bear with. We're all good. So yeah, the weird hissing I am aware of. That was really rude. The weird hissing I am aware of. Um, if anyone knows how to fix it, please leave a comment in the description. I am really... Okay. If anyone wants to know what that says, by the way, it says always kiss me goodnight. My favourite like memories of Christmas is definitely when I was a lot younger and basically we used to get up really early, so every year me and my brother used to take it in turns and one of us would wake the other person up at like 6am, like I'm not even joking. So one of us would like shake the other up and then be like, Merry Christmas, and then we'd all get up and then we'd go, well, me and Thomas would get up, my brother, and we would then go into my parents' room. We'd be like, Merry Christmas, it's Christmas, oh my God, it's so exciting, let's see what Santa's brought us. And then they'd be like, check the time, be like, give it another hour. So they'd make us wait until like, seven o'clock and me and my brother hated it so much and then when we were allowed to get up we'd all stand in a line we'd stand in age order so I would go first then Thomas then my mom then my dad my dad would be like the last one actually no my mum would be the last one because she'd be like making all the beds and we'd be there like oh come on mom we just want to open our presents and then we'd all go downstairs and then we would open Again, it was in age order, so, hold on. Then we would open our presents again in age order, so I would get to open all my presents first, and my brother Thomas hated it. He'd like, can you open them any quicker, because I want to open mine. And I purposely, as I got older, would purposely like, slow down the process. And my dad realised what I was doing, he'd just laugh at me the entire time. So it would go me, Thomas, my mum, and my dad to open presents. It just makes me laugh how the presents got from like this much for me, this much for Thomas, this much for my mum, and then this much for my dad. It would always like get smaller and smaller with the presents. Then about, I'd say about 10, 9, 10 a.m., my grandma would walk down from her house because she used to live in the street behind us. So she would make her way down, sit down with us, and let us go through everything that we've got. And then she'd give us our presents from her. And then after that, we would all get dressed, because we weren't dressed at this point. We'd all get dressed very quickly, go to my nana's, so my dad's family, and literally the entire family would come in, open their presents from nana and granddad, and also from like each other. So like my uncle Dave used to always just like, I'm gonna give you it, nana's, and then we'd have to wait for him, and then you have to open it in front of everybody, and be like, oh my god, thanks. So, we did that, and then all the men would go with my granddad down to church, the pub, um, get drunk, and all the women and the children would stay with my nana, and we'd all just like have a girly session. Me, my auntie, and my nana still do that now, um, but not this year, because they're in Australia, being really selfish. I'm joking, I love you, nana and granddad, I do. Come home soon, please, I miss you. So we would stay there for a while and then my mom would probably go back and start doing the Christmas dinner by a certain point. But we used to, we used to sometimes have dinner, Christmas dinner at my Nana's and then some years we'd have it at home. So it depended on, I guess how lazy my mom was. <laughs> so then we'd go home, make Christmas dinner, play with our toys that we got given and all that jazz um, and I always know that my mum always buys me even now to this day at least one outfit that is Christmas day outfit and she's like right choose your gift 
which one are you wearing today? So that was kind of how that bit works. Um, and then the day just kind of is have your dinner, have your starters, which me and Thomas never ate. It's always prawn cocktail, always my mum's favourite. And then we'd have Christmas dinner, then we'd have a big chocolate gatto, um, which this year I am not doing because I'm a little bit of a health kick, I don't want it. And then it's sort of like we'd all wind down, all just play with our toys and our presents again. Always had. My mum used to always in the morning, I completely missed this bit, for breakfast we'd have sausages, she still does that now, um, and we'd listen to like a CD and I remember my auntie got me a Westlife CD, blaring it out and my brother's just like, can you turn it off, I'm sick of this song, and I just play it and play it and play it and play it and play it. So yeah, that's our day and then eventually the soaps would come on, so me and my mum especially, we'd in our pyjamas, we'd watch, you know, what comes first? Emmerdale, Coronation Street, EastEnders. Now we've got up to Mrs. Brown's Boys comes on every once in a while. Um, but yeah, that's kind of my Christmas and it's a comfortable Christmas. Now it's a bit different, so they're like my Christmas memories. Now I stay at my mum's on Christmas Eve and wake up on Christmas Day at my mum's and then open my presents and then about 10, 11, go to my dad's, open my presents for my dad, then I, usually after that we go to my nana's, but this year it's going to be so different, um, because usually we go to my nana's for a bit and then my dad will go to the church with my granddad with the rest of the uncles, and then we go home, cook Christmas dinner, and then that's the day, but this year I don't know what we're doing, I think this year we're just staying here. But I was like, I'm going to go to the club. I was like, well, no, you're not, because I'm not staying at home by myself. So I kind of shattered those dreams for him. <laughs> Sorry, Dad. Um, so I think this year we're just going to open presents, cook dinner, watch TV. That's it. We need to do something fun. Um, my mum goes to the pub. Sounds more fun, though, let's be honest. We might go to the club. Who knows? But I don't trust my dad when Christmas dinner is on. Um, but yes, that's usually my Christmas covers because I'm older now. <laughs> Literally just two of us left doing this tradition, but no one does it. Like I remember when it was my first Christmas here at my mum's and I was like, we've all got to line up. Mum's boyfriend was just like, what? <laughs> um, but yeah, I definitely still open my Christmas presents first because I'm the youngest, I have the most, and I'm I'm the favourite, so yeah. So always, it's still now with my dad. It's me, them, dad, and then it's me, mum, or then Lee. Um, so yeah, that is basically my Christmas memories. Um, please enjoy the next part of the video. I made this a while ago. I honestly cannot remember. I'm not even gonna take it out if it's bad. I'm gonna watch it after I film this. So this is my Christmas video that I made, I think it was 2013, um, it's at my Nana's house and standard family meal, uh, family video, uh, so yeah enjoy and I will see you on New Year's Eve. What? No it's not, it's not New Year's Eve, is it? I don't, I don't know, it's next, it's next Saturday, so I'll see you next week, enjoy the video, bye!